Welcome back. It's Doug MPA. This is number 19 of my compilation of women on TikTok who regret their student loans. I have 18 more of these, so make sure to check the playlist at the end of this video to watch the other 18. If you've been following my channel long enough, you know that this is my favorite thing to talk about. Why? Because women keep going to these high-priced schools to get degrees nobody cares about that aren't going to make them any money on the job market. It's modern women, guys. Don't get with a woman with a whole bunch of debt. A woman's debt should be a disqualifier for consideration for serious relationship, guys. Don't do it. So we're going to get into this compilation. Before I do that, like the video, subscribe, drop a comment. I really appreciate it. It shows you support me and what I'm doing over here. And let's get into this. In honor of me graduating college this week, I was like, you know what? We're going to rip the bandaid off. We're going to check our student loan debt. And I kind of had a ballpark range. Like I knew how much I owed not down to like the exact dollar amount. I'm the type of person who gets nervous to check their bank account after a weekend out. So I Did you catch that? She said, I'm the type of person that gets nervous to check her bank account after a weekend out. Jesus H. Christ. 44% of women don't budget, guys. They don't know how much money is going out. And this is one of them. She has no idea how much money she, she spends uh, each weekend. Or probably each month. So I took a look. I took a hard gander at exactly how much money I owe. I'm going to die with it. Like, I can confidently say there wasn't even, like, a panic. It was just, like, my heart sank to my ass. Guys, I want you to put in the comments how much you think a woman would have to owe for her heart to sink into her ass. <laughs> Jesus H. Christ. Because I'm going to say about 100000 for her bachelor's degree. She probably went to some private school somewhere, took, about some, took out some private loans, She's probably a hundred thousand dollars in debt for from a bachelor's degree. I'm gonna die with it. Like it's, I don't know any way I'm gonna be able to pay that off, other than selling my organs on the black market. This is why I don't understand why people shit on sugar babies. Cause like I could get this all paid off tomorrow. Or OF. There's a lot of ways a girl this attractive can get that money uh, to pay off her student loans, but she'd have to sell her her soul to do it. In fact, you know, hey. Her OF page might be coming, guys. <laughs> Maybe not tomorrow, but you know what I mean. Like, within the year. If I just found a rich man and everyone's like, patriarchy, don't work for them. Ask not what you can do for the patriarchy, but what the patriarchy can do for you. There it is, guys. There it is. <laughs> Women hate the patriarchy unless it's working for them and for their benefit. I guarantee you through all of her college classes, she's like, oh, yeah, I'm I'm going to be strong and independent out there. Then she got smacked in the face with her student loans. She, 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 she crashed right into the Department of Education. And now she's looking for uh, the, the patriarchy to bail her out. If it benefits me, then maybe it's not the patriarchy. Maybe it's just a helping hand. There you go, guys. She, she's telling ladies. Ask what the patriarchy can do for you. So I just saw this TikTok of this lady saying that she saw a TikTok of this little white girl crying about her student loans and how she just been paying them and paying them and whatever, whatever. <laughs> who? Baby, them student loans is going to the grave with me, okay? Student loan who? Baby, if I didn't get a job that was going to repay them student loans, God paid it all, okay? There you go, guys. There you go. Jesus H. Christ. This is modern women right here. They never should have gave a student loan to this girl in the first place. Because, guys, l l let's be honest. What kind of credit score do you think a woman like this has? Because put that in the comments. I'd say she looks about a 450, 475. She, she probably has a couple of car repos on a record. Maybe a, a eviction or two. And they gave her a big fat student loan to, to go to college. Come on now. I ain't worried about it. God got me. Them student loans gonna be right with me when that pass to say ashes to ashes, dust to dust, and they gonna go on and put the little birds in the air for me and my student loans. And that's that on that. Should have known when they gave me that loan that I wasn't gonna make a payment on it, baby. They seen my credit. They seen my credit when I got the student loan to go to college. They already knew. A student loan can kiss my ass. She even said it. She she said it right there. I was irresponsible before I got a student loan, and I'm going to be irresponsible afterwards. And she's making this TikTok literally saying proudly 
saying that she's not going to pay off her debt. So this, this is modern women, guys. 70% of the student loan debt is owed by women, and too many are just like this girl. Sally Mae, Navient, all of that can go to hell. Don't even look my way. Don't dial my number. Finna be crying over a student loan? Who? I'm not even a student anymore, Buki. That, that's, that don't belong to me. That ain't got nothing to do with me. That ain't none of my business. I'm not a student. I'm an adult now. Didn't Biden say he was going to get rid of the student loans anyway? He need Y'all need to call him. He, he trying to jump ship before he said he was going to do what he was going to do. <laughs> they all thought that Sleepy Joe was going to forgive their student loans. <laughs> Let me give that a big. Nope. <laughs> These student loans want a payment for me. They're going to have to contact Biden. Joseph Biden is his full name. He's the one that's going to handle the student loans from here on out. I ain't got nothing to do with it. Y'all gave me a loan equaling hundreds of thousands of dollars. And y'all seen what I went to college for. And y'all knew that career was not finna repay these damn student loans. That was y'all fault for giving it to me. Y'all should have a much better judge of character and majors when it comes to this college career. She's over $100,000. She's had multiple $100,000 in student loan debt. <laughs> Guys, and I guarantee you, she's... Uh, a degree. And what are the seven? I always say that women get the degrees that aren't worth the paper that they're printed on. Psychology, sociology, social work, criminal justice, some kind of studies degree, gender studies, African-American studies, Asian studies, uh, communications, education. She she looks like a, a social work major, doesn't she? <laughs> you knew I wasn't going to be able to pay that long on this teaching degree. You a teaching degree? I'm going to hit the... Oh my goodness. Who knew that? I right, sir, Navian, Sally May, get off my back. Get off my job. There it is, guys. A teaching degree, multiple hundred thousand dollars in student loan debt, and she has no intent of paying it back. She she's giving Sally May, Navian, the, the Department of Education, and the taxpayers the finger. First off, I hate when people do TikTok videos and drive. You see this little warning down here, participating in this activity could result in you or others getting hurt. Don't drive while you're shooting TikTok videos. So I've decided to quit worrying about it. I'm done worrying about this place. I'm going to keep doing my work and doing my best, and that's going to be good enough because I've got other things to worry about, okay? Like the fact that I got an email last night about my student loan. Yes, I have a ridiculous amount of student loans saying that my loan was in forbearance and that my next payment, not till February, but still, my next payment is over $4,000. $4,000. Jesus H. Christ. God, you guys, yikes. Next year. And I'm like, no, it's not. So now I'm gonna have to get on the phone with those people and figure that out. I must've missed an email somewhere. Maybe I didn't, I need to send my income in again. Probably totally my fault. I probably totally missed something. But I gotta worry about that today. Okay, I'm gonna- How could she miss an email for her income that could have prevented her from paying $4,000 a month? And guys, how much would you have to owe in student loan debt for your payment to be $4,000 a month? Yikes! I'm gonna post a shop video later though. $4,000 a month. Oh my goodness. Stay away from these women, guys. Don't do it. This is not your problem. Yikes. Let me know what you think about this in the comments. Like the video, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.